What's up everybody? John here with another video for those of you that are interested in getting a job on board a cruise ship. This video's topic is going to be another video that's been requested a lot and a question that I get pretty often and that's all about uh, working out, going to the gym. So uh, for those of you that are interested in, in getting the answer to this question, this is the video for you. So one of the questions that I get asked a lot is, hey, um, when I'm working on board, is there going to be a gym that I have access to that I can work out? And the answer is yes. Now, it's not just a simple yes, as with everything that it comes with working on board a cruise ship, um, but there are there's two different gyms that you can have access to. Uh, for the crew members that don't have guest area privileges, there is a crew gym, and it's mostly free weights and a couple uh, machines to work with, depending on the ship. I've seen both uh, that you can go down and you can get a good workout in, so there's that. Um, and then if you do have guest area privileges, you will have access to the guest gym. Now, same thing with eating. Uh, you have to let the guests have priority. So if you have guest area privileges and you go up to the guest gym and the gym is busy, you're not going to be able to work out. If the gym is empty, then you will be able to go up and utilize it, which is why a lot of the crew members who have guest area privileges who use the guest gym will either wait until it's a port day or until it's during dinner time. Usually during dinner time, the guest gym is pretty empty and in the evening it's pretty empty. So they go up and they use the gym up there. Um, but again, some crew members do not have access to that. So they only can use the crew gym. Uh, crew gyms that I have seen had a lot of free weights, um, a lot of uh, benches. So you can do some bench presses and, and, and kind of those and more of like a of a weight like a weight gym kind of thing. Uh, very few gym cruise ships that I've been on have had more of a variety of machines. So it's not it's not much. I'm sure at this point some ships have gotten a little bit more ahead of the times and have gotten their crew more actual uh, equipment. Um, but the ones that I have seen has been very pretty basic, but enough to to kind of hold you over if needed. There's always the option to go outside and run. Um, if you get off in the port, you can do a little running around in the port. Uh, again, if you have guest area privileges, you can go up and there's usually a track on board some of the ships up on the open decks that you can run on. The only thing that's weird about that is even though you are running and you're working out, you still have to have your name tag on. So if you don't mind that, that's fine. You'll be out in the sun and, and enjoying the weather um, and running if it's not too breezy or windy up there, but you still have to have your name tag on so people, the guests will be able to know that you're a crew member and all that fun stuff. So there is ways to work out when you're on the ship. Uh, another good thing is if people are worried about gaining weight, um, every contract that I've worked on, I actually wound up losing a lot of weight because you're working so much and the food you eat is, it's not the best, it's not the best food, but it's not unhealthy food. So you, I don't know, maybe it's just me. Like my metabolism is pretty fast. So working on board every time it came time to eat, I would either make a decision of eating something or taking a nap and nine times out of ten I would take a nap so I would have like a very small snack just enough to hold me over and I would wound up I would wind up coming home my mom would be like oh my god you're so skinny what happened you have to eat and then I'd be on my vacation and I'd eat a little bit more start to put on a little bit more weight to kind of make up and then I would go back to another contract and I would like lose all my weight again so there's always that <laughs> if you're worried about losing weight I'd say uh, join a cruise ship and work and eat very little when you're not working. Um, and then there's people who go the exact opposite and they'll wind up drinking so much that they put on the weight from alcohol. So it's just like going to college for your first year, for your first semester. Um, so I hope that kind of gives you a little bit of insight on the uh, working out stuff. If you're interested and you really are worried about working out when you're on board, that there is crew gyms, and if you do have the access to the guest area, you can use the guest gym, but remember, the guest does have priority. So you will have a way of staying in shape. Uh, if you wanted to, if you really, really needed to, and you wanted to buy some weights to use in your cabin when you're not working, you can do that too. Uh, just remember, space is limited, so don't go buy in a full you know, dumbbell set because you're not gonna have the space to use it. So there's ways. It's like being in a, like a glorified prison, like they have access to a gym in the yard. That sounds really bad. Never mind. It's not like prison at all. But it's like, you know, even when you're in jail, you have access to a gym. It's kind of like that, maybe, uh, but nicer. <laughs> so if you're worried about working out, fear not. You still can get your, your lift on, if that's what they say when they, people go to the gym. I don't know. I was a swimmer. I did, uh, you know, basic 
you know, <laughs> dry land exercises and I swam laps. That was my workout. I didn't do any uh, lifts or curls or all that stuff. And I, yeah, awesome, cool. Way to go, way to go, John. <laughs> so yeah, hope this helps. If you have any questions uh, regarding any of the fitness center needs and any type of workout stuff, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Be sure to like and subscribe uh, to my channel and uh, stay tuned for some more videos. Lots more on the way. Lots of different topics coming up. And if you have any ideas for any topics or anything that you wanna see, please feel free to let me know in the comments below. Head on over to my Facebook page, facebook.com slash John Gleason Comedy. Send me a message there, like that page, and stay tuned. I got lots more stuff coming your way. Once again, I'm John, and thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you later.